Yo, what is going on guys? So it is Sunday and I'm just starting off my meal prep. I figured I'd take you guys through my three overnight oats breakfast meal prep recipes that I've been using over the last couple of weeks to help me lean down and also keep my breakfast awesome. So let's get into it. All right, so first up, we've got the s'mores overnight oats. We're gonna go ahead and use 90 grams of oats. And then we got a scoop of vanilla whey protein. And then from here, we'll add 150 grams of a Fairlife reduced fat free milk. I'm just gonna scrape the sides just so that the milk gets to the bottom. And then we've got 80 grams of a fat-free Greek yogurt. And then we've got about five grams or one tablespoon of a sugar-free toasted marshmallow syrup. You guys can go ahead and substitute that out for a vanilla extract if you don't have this. And then we've got about a half a tablespoon of graham cracker crumbs. Can't forget the chocolate chips. That's about 10 grams of chocolate chips. And since it is a s'mores overnight oats, we can't forget the marshmallows. We're gonna go ahead and add four to five grams of your favorite marshmallows. And there's your s'mores overnight oats recipe. We're gonna go ahead and put a cap on this and then toss this in the fridge, let it sit overnight. You should be good in the morning. One thing to remember when you're making these overnight oats, you guys can adjust the liquid proportions to your own preference. So if you wanna add a little bit more liquid, feel free to. I personally like my oats to be a little bit thicker when I wake up in the morning. Uh, but otherwise, if you like things a little bit more runny, just add in a little bit more Greek yogurt or also a little bit more of the fat-free milk. Next up, we've got our apple pie overnight oats. All the bases of these overnight oats recipes are virtually the same, just with minor tweaks. So we've got 90 grams of oats, 150 grams of a Fairlife. Then we've got 80 grams of a fat-free Greek yogurt. Let's give this a good mix, just so that all the dry oats can evenly soak up all the liquids. And then we've got a scoop of your favorite vanilla whey protein powder. And then the start of the show, we're gonna go ahead and use a Skittles green apple water flavor enhancer. Now this is gonna really help to bring out the flavor, but also help sweeten the overall overnight oats. I'm only using maybe a gram or half a teaspoon of this. So just remember a little goes a long way. And then to help balance out some of that green apple flavor, we're gonna go ahead and use about 10 grams of a zero sugar Cool Whip. Now I'm gonna go ahead and top this off with some fresh cut apples. You do as you wish, but this is totally optional. This is also optional as well, but we're gonna go ahead and use half a tablespoon of some graham cracker crumbs. Otherwise, this is ready to go. I'm gonna go ahead and put a cap on it, toss this in the fridge. Should be good for the next few days. Starting off with the same base, we're gonna go ahead and use 90 grams of oats. Then we got one scoop of your favorite vanilla protein and also Transparent Labs French toast and cinnamon pastry whey protein powders work really well with this one. And then we've got 80 grams of a fat-free Greek yogurt. And then we'll top it off with 150 grams of a fat-free Fairlife. And then to get that maple flavor, we're gonna go ahead and use about 20 grams of your favorite sugar-free maple syrup, or you can go ahead and use a couple drops of your favorite imitation maple extract. And then to finish this off, we're gonna go ahead and use one tablespoon of pecans. And a great thing about overnight oats is that you can leave them in the fridge for up to a week. And not only that, the longer that they sit in the fridge, flavors will marinate and get that much stronger. But otherwise, these three flavors are great just to kind of switch things up. Every day I get a little bit of a different taste and also something to look forward to. And there's our maple pecan overnight oats. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. There's three different flavors. Tweak them as you wish and however they fit best with your macros and your overall calories. But otherwise, in the meantime, stay safe, stay swole, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.